Tradition and Innovation Johann Dietrich Müller founds his optics company in Wedel in 1864 in an entrepreneurial climate that is influenced by the Industrial Revolution. In 1875, Müller builds a soda water factory at Rosengarten, which his brother Joachim runs from 1883 until it burns down in 1915. The early industrialization period was over and a general mood of optimism prevails. Coal mining increases, mechanical engineering flourishes, and the railway network expands in Germany. Johann Dietrich's son Hugo is the one who builds up this small workshop into an industrial company from 1908 onwards. It is the huge success of his prism binoculars abroad in particular that allows him to survive the growing inflation after World War I. There are even emergency funds covered by foreign currency in the inflation year 1923. In the same year, MAN installs the first diesel engines in HGVs. After World War II, the third generation in the company, Alfred and Dr. Hans Müller, succeed in entering the medical technology field with ophthalmological and microsurgical equipment. Germany is in the midst of reconstruction, and the world marvels at the first instant camera and microwave oven in the USA. During the economic miracle, Müller Wedel expands its medical technology segment. In 1961, the Russian cosmonaut Gagarin is the first person to circumnavigate the Earth. The Beatles conquer the whole world from Hamburg. The first ceiling-mounted surgical microscope, Müller Spezial, appears in 1966 and the introduction of the world's first operating microscope with variable focus follows in 1975 under the management of Jürgen and Klaus Müller. At this time, you can buy the first personal computer kit in the USA and the Viking 1 space probe lands on Mars. In 1985, Dr. Fyodorov carries out production line ophthalmic surgery at his Moscow clinic with the support of the companies Müller and Siemens. Müller Wedel becomes part of the Hagstreich group, while Germany experiences a peaceful revolution and reunification. The first computer-controlled operating microscope for ophthalmology, Müller Optamic 900, is launched on the market, and the CD-ROM is developed as a storage medium. The new surgical operating microscope, Müller VM900, with bi-directional interface for neural navigation systems, follows in 1994. In the 2000s, the iPod, iPad, and iPhone enrich people's everyday lives. The Cassini-Huygens space probe reaches Saturn's orbit. The operating microscope, Müller High R900 for ophthalmology and reconstructive surgery with high-resolution apochromatic optics and the microscope system, Müller 21000 with permabalance and senso servo technology are developed. In 2012, all sales and marketing activities are transferred to the newly founded Hagstreit Surgical. In the same year, the intraoperative IOCT is introduced. Trend-setting developments originate from the intensive interchange of ideas with international physicians. Tradition and innovation are the basis of outstanding technical developments. This applies to the history of the world, and in particular, to the history of Hagstreit Surgical.